shots that we've already done were done with a 24 millimeter lens. That I was up close and personal with our skater. The reason for that, it gives a different perspective on the sports action. But while I'm just looking at it, I'm seeing a very beautiful sporting shadow down there. So I might pop off a shot like that. The thing about sports photography is to make great sporting shots, you've got to look at every aspect of it. It's not just the sport, it's the surroundings as well. Okay, just down here, what I'm seeing is this wonderful, excellent overview of the entire area. So I'm going to get that for a background shot. So what I'm going to do now is use the 70 to 200 mil so that I can stand at the edge of the field of play. It will give me a very different perspective and a very different shot. I'm going to shoot this on 70 mil. And again, whoa, 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 a very different perspective. I had that on 160 and I think that that's a very slow shutter speed. So I'm going to speed it right up to 1 800th of a second. One more. Uh. So this is now one eight hundredth of a second. And we're shooting our skater. I'm panning, as you can see, moving backwards and forwards with the action. He's very good, our skater. And there he goes. Excellent work. OK, so thank you very much. <laughs> Always be polite to your subjects <laughs> and always give them photos as well. Our skater turning around and giving me a nice portrait. <laughs> there you go, lovely. Thank you so much, really appreciate it.